I will be showing you a little video on the first factory unlocked iPhone from Sprint. I mean, not factory unlocked, but it works internationally on any network. So we'll be testing this phone after it was unlocked by Sprint with two different SIM cards to see what happens. We're going to try one, the AT&T SIM card from the United States. See what happens with the activation process when we put this one through. <laughs> and after that, we're going to use an international SIM card from my country here. So let's begin. The phone has been confirmed to be unlocked. So let's put the SIM card. We're going to try on it. So this is the SIM card that came with the phone. This is the Sprint SIM card, as you can see here. And uh, this is this is a Sprint SIM card, as you can see. And we're going to go for the AT&T SIM card, which is this one. Okay, so there's no AT&T service in my country, and this SIM card is not even active. But it works for the activation process to see if Sprint allows the Sprint iPhone 4S to be used with US carriers. So, let's see what happens this time. So, you are on the activation screen, okay? As usual. You're gonna go through the steps. You're gonna pick the language you're gonna use. You're gonna choose the language, in this case, English. You're gonna go for it. And you're gonna choose the country, let's just leave it like that. And let's see. We're connected to Wi Fi. Says the SIM card is in the phone. Let's see what happens next. Okay? So, since this is a US SIM card, all you get is only compatible SIM cards for supported carriers may be used to activate iPhone. Remember, Sprint is not like Verizon, which has an uh, unlocked phone even in the US. They just offer an international unlock, so you can use, if you're abroad, you can use a SIM card from a local carrier. So, I'm going to put a SIM card from Orange, Dominican Republic, and let's see what happens in that same spot. Okay, this is start up. Let's put the SIM card in the phone. Okay, it's in. And let's see now what happens. Let's keep English. Okay, it's reading the SIM card now as it is. Let's go next. And let's see. What happens this time? See now it didn't show you that message because you're using a SIM card that is not from the US. Since it is not from the US, you can use the phone fine. It should grab signal any second. So once the phone goes through the activation process with another SIM card, you're able to complete the setup on the activation and you are actually able to get into the actual phone. So let's see how it grabs signal. See? It's showing orange as the carrier. So this is a Sprint phone unlocked to be used internationally. Okay? You can see the model number MD667. It's a 64 gigs one and it's being used on Orange Dominican Republic. Okay? That was it. Remember to subscribe if you like what you see here. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.